guys? It's the Weird Food Dude, and today I'm going to be trying three different types of chips. I've got Packy Chips. These are fiery chili lemon flavored. They're sort of like a uh, tortilla chip. And then we've got Lentil Chips as well with Himalayan pink sea salt. Those should be interesting. Never had lentil, uh, lentil chips before. And then another thing that I've never had before, cassava strips. Um, so this is going to be barbecue. So we got one spicy, one sweet, one salty, one dollar each. Uh, the, the two, so these ones are from Kroger. They were marked down. All three of these were. Um, and then the other two were from TJ Maxx. So all three of them a dollar. I'm going to go ahead and say this right now. All of them are worth trying. I mean, you know, weird chips for a dollar, you, you really can't go wrong. Um, but let's start off with the cassava strips. These ones are the ones I'm the, sort of most intrigued by. Um, don't really know what to expect. Don't honestly know what a cassava is. Mmm. I'm not big on those. You know what it tastes like at first is like pumpkin, sort of. Like if you take a, a raw pumpkin and just like bite a chunk out of it, that's what these taste like. I'll, t I'll try a second one just to see if that was like just a, you know, Yeah, I'm really, I don't, the aftertaste in this is not great either. The barbecue's very, very, very subtle. You can hardly really taste it. Not, not a fan. I'm going to give those a 3 out of 10, I think. Pretty low rating to start off with. Hopefully, it'll get better from there. But yeah, um, so the cassava strips, and in fact, I'm going to take away that, that preemptive uh, recommendation. Would not say those are worth trying, even for a dollar. Unless you've had cassava, you like cassava then, you know, maybe you'll like them. Um, but, yeah, 3 out of 10, would not buy. One of few on this channel. So next we're gonna be trying the lentil chips. These ones are just the Himalayan, I think, sea salt. They sort of look like, sort of Frito shape, just a little longer. Those are a lot better. They taste, um, they actually taste pretty similar to Fritos, just like a plain Fritos. I don't know if it's, I don't know what lentils are either, to be honest. I, I mean, I think they're like a, like, a, like a seed type thing or whatever. Um, but I've never had them, like, that I know of. Like, I never, never seeked them out. I might have had them in, like, in like a soup or something. I think that's what you put them in. Um, but yeah, they're kind of, they're, they are very similar to Fritos. Yeah, those are definitely a lot better. Um, those ones, I think I'm gonna give for a, I'm gonna give for a 6.5 out of 10. They're still not like amazing. They're, they're not even great either. They're, they're, they're good, they're just good. 7.5, you know, middle of the road. Did I say 7, I, I meant 6.5. I think I said that the first time. But yeah, 6.5, little bit over the halfway mark of the five. Um, I don't wanna, I don't wanna trash them too much. They're, they're still pretty good. Um, if you like Fritos, you probably like them. For some reason, they taste uh, too similar to those. Um, but, I mean, honestly, if I saw them again at the store for a dollar, I'd probably buy them. So, having having already tried them. So now, to the Packy Chips. Just looks like a Dorito. Probably gonna taste similar to like a spicy Dorito, I would imagine, but let's find out. don't like those. I'll, I'll give it a second go. Really hearing my jaw today. That second bite was a little bit better. It's um, so the thing is, right, this is one of those ones where if you like spicy stuff, you'll probably like these. It is pretty hot. It's not super hot, like it says on the, on, on the bag. But I think if I ate a serving of these, I probably would be working on a little bit of sweat. I can feel it almost coming in right now. Um, but it's it's not like a... It's not like nacho -y, like you would expect it by looking at it. You know, it looks like a, like a Dorito. Um, it does more lean more on the sort of chili lemon. So I guess if you're looking for, like, 
chili lemon, which is what it was. I don't know why I was expecting sort of a nacho kind of thing, um, but it's uh, it's more more spicy than it is flavorful, like zesty or whatever. Um, and then you do get a little bit of the the sort of lemon aftertaste as well. So it it you know it is what it says it is. Um, they they've got a nice little flavor there, but not for me personally. I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it a three out of ten as well. You know what? No, no, no. It's it's better than it's better than the cassava chips. I'll give it I'll give it a four out of ten. And this one is uh, unlike the other one. I'm gonna keep its its preemptive. Uh, would I buy it? Yes, yes, I would buy it for a dollar. I'd try these. My girlfriend would probably like them. Um, she likes more spicy things. But that's gonna do it for this video. Make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys next time.